electric scooter. It's awesome. And we're at 75, 78. Come on, let's make a full stop. Yeah, let's do it with 50. That was fun. That was all right. We're driving and we're going for a test ride. And uh, it's, it's really quiet and I'm freaking loving it. I hear nothing, I feel nothing, but still it kind of pushes hard. This one is the, the low version and uh, it's so much fun. I can't believe how light it is. You don't hear anything, you don't feel anything. It's awesome. And uh, in here is 60 uh, kilometers an hour and we're going to push it up to 80. Maybe it works, maybe not. Let's see where the limit is. And there's a different, uh, different version of that one that goes up to 90. And with the one that goes up to 90, you're also allowed to go on the highway, which I'm totally gonna do. By the way, I'm in the full jacket ship, which looks really funny. So let's see, up here we can push it. So let's go on 60. And I'm giving it a full throttle here, man, I'm so excited. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, let's give it a full throttle. We're up to 60, 65, 67. Oh my God, it's pushing, man. 70, no, 68, 70. All right, we got the 70, no, 72, awesome. Oh my God, I'm so stoked about it. You hear nothing, not even a wink or anything you hear nothing at all and it's really light really nice to drive and we're at 75 78 come on push it up to 80 80 okay I'm loving it it's a little windy I can feel the wind quite hard because it's so light I feel like the wind is pushing Side and I'm pulling the scooter with me. Okay, now I have to slow down to 50. Feel nice and chill. Oh my god, this feels like nothing. And it's kind of hard to normally normally when you go on 50 with uh, with your bike, you hear it and you know the gear you're in and you hear the sound of the engine and you know you're fast enough or you're too slow. It's like you get used to it. But in here, you're missing that at all. So I always have to check my Tacho. Oh, let's see that. Yeah, no, he fucking hates me because I'm driving a scooter. Okay. And in here, you always have to watch the Tacho. Uh, you have to feel how fast you are. You can't hear it with the engine. So that's quite uh, something to get used to. So now I'm not having anyone behind me. Let's make a full stop. And we're allowed to go 60. So let's do that with 60 and uh, yeah, let's do, let's do a full front with 50. Yeah, let's do it with 50. That's, it's not too bad. I feel alright. I'm not sure if it has a OBS system in the front. I'm giving it a full throttle here in the front with 20. Yeah, I think it has ABS. I'm not sure, actually. I have to ask about that, which I'm totally gonna do. So now we're driving up here to see the view and just get a little bit more. It's really strange. Uh, I'm always not sure how fast I go, so because you can't hear it at all. And uh, I always have to check the, the display for... And now I'm only going 30, but I feel like I'm going 40 or 50, maybe. Okay, it's really weird uh, driving this thing. And we're gonna go up there. And, uh, we're not allowed to drive there. Okay, let's go back. But this was really fun and uh, really light. So the battery is gonna last for 80 to 90 kilometers. And it takes about 8 hours to recharge. Let's see. Yeah, it has an ABS in front. Yeah. But not 100%, so uh, we see about that. It's, it's really light to drive. I mean, the handling is just nice. The turns is alright, and I think you can go really deep in the turn. In the, oh, yeah. 
Let's go. Let's go a little deeper in this turn. Oh, I'm oh, I'm still finding the the throttle point. It's, it's kind of weird because it doesn't have the full power, and uh, I'm kind of missing a little power in the, by the turns. When I'm turning, I, I'd like to give it a little throttle out, but I'm kind of missing that. Um, but otherwise, it's really awesome. It's really light. It's really nice with the handling and. Yeah, let's see if we can drive freehand as well. Can we? Yes. Can we turn a little? Yes, we can still control it. So this is actually awesome. It's quite a hard wind and I'm pushing with my with my hip against it to keep it straight and it works perfectly. So it's, it's really nice. Um, I have to say the handling is great. Just uh, the power thing, but this one is a small version, so there is a, there is power uh, more powerful. And now check out the beautiful view while I'm pushing it back to 80. This is the Greifense. It's awesome for swimming. Also, it's a natural. Oh my God, we're already on 80. Can we push it further? We're not allowed to, but we're going to. No, we can't. We can't. Yeah, 85. That's enough. Okay, so I'm really happy about that. Uh, it's really light, and I feel like uh, I feel like it, it is drivable. I can imagine going to work with that one every day. Also, like for swimming or something, we can put the bags in here. We're gonna put a fucking shit in the back to to take a, like a case or something, and also. Underneath the, the the sit, where underneath where you're sitting here, there's some space to uh, to how do you say to carry some stuff. So you can put some stuff in here. Probably better not liquid because the oh 60 because the uh, the battery is in there. But you can charge your phone in there as well. There's a USB uh, charger plug. Huh? What else to say? You can drive like that, it's pretty cool. Oh my god, that feeling. But you can't stir like that. It would be cool if you can stir like that. Uh, if you can turn like that. Okay, so I'm quite liking the sitting positions as well. Going like, going like this. And also you can go into the race position. That's all right, that's all right. Okay, let's see if he tells, uh, he says hello. Hi, how you doing? No, 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 he was like, fuck you, you're a scooter dude. Man, he doesn't know, he doesn't know. My friends, when you're on the street, somebody greets you, even if it has a scooter, it's a guy on two wheels, so say hello, be kind, have fun, enjoy the weather, that's what it's all about. So, we're bringing back this bad boy. I'm really enjoying driving that one, it's really light, it stays in position very well, so I'm kind of thinking about getting that one as a second uh, second, uh, uh, second bike to get around, I mean, there's really not, no reason to go to work with my chopper, and oh yeah, by the way, uh, if you drive 100 kilometers, it's 80 rappe, so it's uh, it's like it's like a half a dollar on 100 kilometers. So it's not much. I can go to work with one charge of this bad boy, 90 kilometers. I can go to work a whole week. So there's just no question. It's really much cheaper, and price-wise, it's not really bad. I'm paying like four grand for this, and it's. I have to say. Oh, oh, the, yeah, the, the brakes are really good. Really good. Okay, now that we're standing, let's try to drive backwards. Because when you push that one and you pull the... Oh my god! The gas it has a... You can drive backwards. It's really fun. Okay. I never... I never drove backwards. 
before my life, man. So I'm riding bikes since more than 10 years without any accidents. Well, never, never my fault. But uh, this is fun. I have to say, this is really, really fun. So let's. Alright, so that was the test drive with the electric scooter. I have to say, that was fun. That was really fun. Uh, more than I expected. It's way, way more quiet than I expected. The driving is much easier than I suspected it, than I was expecting it. And uh, all in all, I have to say, I'm totally gonna get one. And there is a compensation for the CO2 you can buy as well, which is about 60, 66 bucks or something. And then your CO2 neutral. So I'm going to do that as well, and the electricity we get at home is 100% from Swiss Renewable Energies. So all the driving is going to be CO2 neutral and renewable. That's awesome. I never thought that in 2020 I'm going to achieve CO2 neutral transportation. That bad boy, my little lady, of course I'm gonna keep my lady, man. I mean, you can give it a full throttle and you can't do that with the other one. And it's just much more fun. And also my girlfriend thinks it's very sexy. No, uh, I'm, I just grew up with a chopper. And I can't imagine a life without a chopper. So I'm keeping that one. And I'm taking a number I can switch, right, man? And uh, that way I'm saving some insurance. Right now I pay about 250 bucks a year. And I think with the electric one it's gonna go up about 350-ish bucks a year. So it's not too bad. And uh, yeah, I'm kind of stoked about that. I think I can save a lot, a lot of money in the long term. And uh, an important thing about it is also that the electric scooter is, uh, is for two people as well. So there is a Socios place and you can... Well, uh, there's a storage up there. And you can uh, have like your girlfriend or mate in the back and even go on the highway. Uh, that's really nice. So let's go for a ride with my lovely lady. It's a Honda VF 750 Custom from 1988. So this bad boy is around 30. Uh, yeah, 32 years old. And it's driving beautiful. I'm really in love with this motorcycle. It's heavy. It's like a boat. It's like when you go out, you feel like you're on a boat. It's just really steady. Even if you go up to 150, it's really steady and uh, really stable in the, in the turns. Really stable with uh, high, with high speed. And just driving that one is so much fun. You can go further as well. In Switzerland we have a lot of mountains and we have beautiful mountain ways. Uh, how to say? We have beautiful streets in the mountains. So I 
think there's no way I'm gonna get rid of the chopper. Just because uh, I have to go into the mountains a few times in the year to switch off my mind, to go driving. And there's so many nice, beautiful turns up there. And beautiful panoramic scenes. It's just one thing about life I can't give up, man. It's such a pleasure to go into the nature with this crazy engine, with this crazy machine underneath. Yeah, that's part of life, part of enjoying life. Enjoying life at its finest is so important. And also to be thankful for every moment you can go out and drive, for every moment you can go outside and breathe fresh air. Oh, it's learning, but still it's treating me yeah, a cool guy. <laughs> oh man. I really hope it's driving well. Let's see, uh, we're going on the highway. So we have to turn right. And right. Thank you. What a beautiful day. So nice. So, so nice. It's probably one of the last summer days. Oh yeah, and by the way, let's... <laughs> by the way, let's talk about the Corona situation. So here in Switzerland, you know, have to wear a mask in the public transportation. And in my region where I live, uh, from now on, we have to wear a mask as well in shops. Otherwise, it's kind of kind of lifted. At the end of uh, October, they're planning to reorganize all the big events, and you can go up to 3,000 people for a concert. Which is ridiculous. Yeah. So let me know. How's the situation at your place? Is it worse? Is it getting better? I don't think it's gonna go away anytime soon. Stop. Uh, should I go? No, no, let's wait it out. That one's going. Yeah, it's, uh, it's really something different to go with the electric scooter back to the gear shifted chopper. Much better sound. Okay. Oh, what a kind guy. Giving someone a smile and they'll always be perfect. <laughs> yeah, it's a windy day. It's a really windy day. So let's see if we can find the highway in something like a green sign. Oh, and it goes in this direction, so I went the wrong way. Going back, why not? Oh, that feeling when you realize you're driving and your pocket is open and your key is in the pocket. Yeah, that's me. So 
something that always happens. Also, when I park the motorcycle, you can be sure, 10 minutes after I park my motorcycle, I'm searching for the key. It's just a habit I can't get rid of. I'm always freaked about it. Fuck, did I left the key up there? <laughs> All right, let's go there. Cheers. Okay, basically that was it from today. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great one. Think about getting an electric scooter as well. It's really worth it. And if not, let me know in the comments why you shouldn't. All the best to you. Let's stay this. Let's go through this together. We all want. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go through this crisis together. We all want. We all gonna survive. With that said, like, subscribe, hit the bell, and also give me a good comment for some good, good luck. All the best. See you next time. Bye. <laughs> Love this.